Expect hazy sunshine on Saturday, more clouds on Sunday with rain arriving late. Good Friday afternoon, East Tennessee. David Aldrich, Captain Accurate here from the Captain Accurate Weather Command Center. Well, Thanksgiving is just a few short days away. It's next Thursday, and the trend right now from the forecast standpoint would put us in the mid-30s in the morning, mid-50s in the afternoon under partly sunny skies, and just some spots of rain possible. No big deal heading into Thursday of next week. But Sunday morning, as we move into the second half of your weekend, uh, we're going to see the clouds begin to increase from the west. Rain will be already affecting Memphis, Nashville, and Jackson but should be here towards sunset, sunset on, say, Knoxville, and I'm knocking on the door because the afternoon will also open the door for some of the coldest air of the season so far. So what you see in purple moving down from Canada will work its way toward Minneapolis-St. Paul, and that sets up for some very cold air for us Monday and Tuesday, respectively. Now, later Sunday afternoon and evening, the rain will fill in, especially as the sun goes down now just before 525 in the evening, but we'll find an overall setup that keeps it a little soggy at times, maybe a half inch of rain by then, but the blast of cold air coming in on Monday and Tuesday. Some of the coldest air of the season so far, and today was cold, but to next week could be even colder by a few degrees, and we want you to be prepared for that chill. Not a whole lot of clouds seen today. We've seen a beautiful blue sky for much of the day here on Friday, but since midnight, we dropped down to 27 in Knoxville. That was the coldest morning since April 3rd. That's going back seven and a half months. Next week, we could be down about 23, 24. It will be much colder, but there were some 23s and 24s this morning in places like Oneida, Jamestown, and Middlesbrough. So it's really dependent on where you live. Temperatures at right, 3 o'clock today, making a run toward our expected high of 51. We're at 50 in Knoxville. It's 52 in Teleco Plains in Athens and 50 degrees in Oak Ridge. Winds are still busy out of the northeast running about 14 miles per hour during the 3 o'clock hour. Now the football playoffs tonight, whether it's Maryville Farragut or many of the other games that are going on, think layers, mostly clear sky, some high clouds coming in mainly overnight, but 36 at 9 o'clock, 33 by 11, it will be pretty cold if you're sitting still in the bleachers. 28 for an overnight low in Lafollette, Campbell County. 24 Middlesbrough, expecting a low in Athens, around 29 to start the day tomorrow morning. Now the Big Blue H moving well across the Ohio Valley. We'll keep it nice and dry. Heading into Saturday, some high clouds start to stream in that you won't see here. But we'll go up to about 57 tomorrow. That's about 6 degrees warmer than today. Then we go into Sunday, it starts dry. But then all of a sudden, by about 3 o'clock, it's already raining in areas near Cookville. And then it really slides into Knoxville by 530. It's already dark. It's already dark by that point, and it's raining in the fall. It's raining in places like Madisonville and over towards, say, uh, Kingston at that time. But 8.30, 9 o'clock, best chance to get some rain, about a half inch expected as it slides out. May end as a few snow flurries. May end as a few snow flurries in blue in the Smokies. Really not a big deal. As that slides away, we have more sunshine expected on Monday, and it gets gradually cooler after an early high Monday of 50. So more high clouds on Saturday. More clouds on Sunday, think of it mostly cloudy, with rain arriving late and some colder air arrives next week. That's what we expect. Not a whole lot to see around the country. Maybe some lake effect snows around New York State, but it is pretty quiet. Sunday night, 80% chance of rain, 20% chance on Monday morning, and some of that could be uh, snowflakes in parts of the higher elevations. But then a 40% chance of rain coming in on Black Friday of next week. So for tonight, we're down to 30, mostly clear, frosty cold. Winds out of the northeast, about 3 to 8 miles per hour. Tomorrow, Saturday, 57 with sunshine, some high clouds a bit milder with light and variable winds. Here is your Captain Accurate Weather Authority forecast for Knoxville and East Tennessee. 57 Saturday, 58 on Sunday. We're down to 50 and falling on Monday, but then it's pretty cold. I'd say a high of 44 when the normal high is 59. We're going to be running pretty cold on Tuesday, still pretty chilly on Wednesday, but spots of rain possible again next Thursday in time for the holiday itself. By the way, you can keep track of it all using the Captain Accurate weather app. It's free, powered by my friends at Fox Toyota in Clinton, I-75, exit 122. Keep you and your family safe. Just search Captain Accurate at the App Store and Google Play. Well, my name is David Aldridge. Some people call me Captain Accurate. It's not easy being accurate, so weather doesn't surprise you. We'll see you here next time. Take care. <laughs>